This may be the most informal interview I ever do with a Survivor contestant. Redneck James, it's been a long time, dude. What's going on in your world? Uh, uh. Okay. Yeah, okay. What's, I tell you what's going on in my world, man. It's what's up? Show. My Talk show. Check this out. Yo, yo. I do Dish Network. I make about three grand a week because I'm a badass dude. And I got a hot chick who's a stripper. And, you know, I dig her every night. And I come to these events and I check out the chicks and I dance with them. And if they got nice boobs, oh yeah. I'm hooking up, I'm checking. So, yo, what's up? You got some nice tatas. Come on. You know, so I give them the dance. You know, and I give them a look. You know, most people go in here, I ain't even got a name tag, okay? Walk in here, I ain't got no name tag. All right, see, you see the name tag? Hell no. All right, so I'm walking in here, and you walk like this. What's up? What's up? Yeah. So like that. And I tell them, I say, yo, I'm checking you out, you know? And they know automatically. I Survivor James, or I'm somebody, somebody special, you know? So I be doing it. Ooh, come here, baby. See, I got an example. Come here. Woo, woo. Hey, 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 hey. Come here. Oh, yeah. We'll get you an example. I, get you. I don't know what's happening. Yeah, you don't know what's going to happen. Okay. You, what, hi, what's your name? My name's Lonnie. Lonnie. Are you married? Not yet. You, you get married though, right? Yes. You got a freaking ring in your nose. What's up with that? It's freaking green. I know, right? It's my favorite color. And there's a ring in your lip. How much have you had to drink? Do you have a ring? You know. No. Okay, okay. But anyhow, I'm, I'm doing Nothing an example. from here. No, okay, you, so you got nothing like that. No yeah. sensational or oh, I feel good stuff? No? Because my sister said she did that once, and she was walking, and she had an orgasm every time. No. No, okay. I wouldn't know. All right, well, that's all right. But anyhow, I want to make example. Okay. Do you know who I am? <laughs> okay, but if I wasn't wearing a name tag and you didn't know me, you, didn't know, you wouldn't know who I am, right? I might because I've met you before. Okay, but if you never met me, you wouldn't know who I am, right? Probably not. Okay, so this is how I walk up on a woman. And I say, this is who I am. Sorry, it's okay, baby. Hey, honey, you're the husband. Don't shoot her, okay? This is normal, okay? I'm a celebrity. I am qualified to do this. Don't try this at home. So anyhow, I come up on a woman, and I say, I be walking around because they don't know who I am, and I go like this, right? So I make eye contact, right? Yeah. Yeah, and when I look, and I look down, right? See, when I look down, that's when you say, holy shit, the fires are burning, and you're thinking, Oh, I need a picture with this guy. So then we get pictures and we do it like this. Yeah. Hey, 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 get the pictures, get the pictures, get the pictures, get the pictures. Come here. So then we go take pictures like this. Oh, yeah. The picture. Oh, now she's shy because she's on. Okay. I have to make sure the alcohol is in the pictures. Alcohol, because we're drunk. Everybody, everybody, everybody. Everybody. Come here, baby. Come here, baby. Hey, Big Mike. Big Mike. Come here, buddy. This is, my, this is my friend, Big Mike. What up, Big Mike? What's up? How you doing? Hey, I'm good, man. Hey, hey, come here. Big Mike, where are you from? I'm from uh, Wilmington, Ohio. Okay. Ohio. Do they do the incestual thing there? Not as bad as in Alabama. Okay. Oh, oh nobody did it. I know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, in Alabama, you know, we really do do that a lot. We fornicate with the ins people. The family reunions are dating service. I went to, yeah, I went to, when I was young, 15, I went to a family reunion to pick up a chick. She's my cousin, and I like didn't fornicate. Oh, you're good to go for you, second child. You know, or? that's right. Second cousin, you're good to go, and you can fornicate. First cousin, you cannot do that. Just stay first through third base. And first through third base, okay. that's it, all right? All right. Okay, Mike. <laughs> it's, you want more? But there's nobody here to fornicate, to, I mean, talk to. You've, you've turned this into your show. This is my show. This is the Survivor James television show. And if you're hearing this, you need to make me your host, okay? I am much better. Well, I'm not quite as qualified as Jeff Probst because the man has a freaking photographic memory, really. He takes pictures with shit, and he just embeds it in his brain. But anywho... You know, I could be a host with the most dude. Let me tell I hope this is online because you people need to see the truth. 
We're here doing a fundraiser for the policemen and the firefighters of Louisville, Kentucky. And I hope to spread it down to Louisiana or Alabama, you know, and we need to get, because there's some hot chicks down there and they show some stuff, okay? So you need to come visit and check her out, all right? Because they like to see boobies, all right? And we got a customer here. How you, hey, 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 come here, come here, come here, come here. Come here, I, I, my name's James, I'm a host. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Come here. You want to be on TV? No. I, how about you, young lady? This is not going to TV. You're bashful. You can't be bashful. What's your name? Come here. You, you know, you're the nameless man. Okay. Okay. Amish man. What's your name? Okay. How about you? Kelly, how you doing? You want to come talk? No. Is that your husband? You need to stop him. He'll run off without you. Come here. What's your, I'm not going to hurt you. Okay. I, okay. Husband, what, what's your husband's name? Brian, are you a certified uh, martial artist? Put the mic in her face. Oh, uh, yeah. Hey, is your husband a certified martial artist? Well, um, he's an actuary, so an, an, he conquers numbers. An actuary conquers numbers? Yes. That sounds like something. That, when I was in Australia, they had an actuary. I thought it was for birds. Oh, well, you know, I kind of think it is because I'm not much of a number person, so, you know. Uh, okay. Okay, now, your husband, is. does he, like, beat people up? Uh, he could, you know, if he gets mad enough. Okay, I don't want to get beat up, so oh, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and be really a gentleman. What's your husband's name? His name is Brian. Brian! I'm going to be a gentleman, okay? okay? Do not come over here and hurt me, okay? All right, okay, so what's your name? My name is Kathy. Kathy, you already told me that and I forgot. It's okay. That's all right, I'm inebriated. Sorry, I just punched you in the face with the <laughs> microphone. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's okay. I'm a little bit inebriated <laughs> as well. So, you know, that's right. okay. Kathy, what do you do for a living? I am a physical therapist technician. Okay, Brian, I'm sorry, but I just have this uncanny problem, okay? Do not shoot me. <laughs> but you know what? It, you could be my physical therapist anytime, okay? <laughs> sure, sure. Okay, okay. I'll I have to, Do I have to pay you? Well, yeah, okay. yeah. Does yeah. Brian have to be there? Yeah, he's got to be there, you know. But I thought he was an actuary. Well, he is, but he's got the um, insurance part of it down. So I'm the provider, and he's the insurance. Damn, Brian. Okay, I'm just not going to hurt your wife. This is your wife, right, Brian? Okay. Let's let the record know Brian nodded yes. Very meanly with a shotgun brow, okay? Kathy, it is a pleasure talking to you. You have a wonderful day. Thank you. You do the same. Yes, ma'am. Bye-bye. Right. So, tell us about your tie. What was the motivation for the tie? My tie has Spider-Man effect. Okay. And last time I was here, I was red and black, and I went into Goodwill of Louisville to get a red tie. The Goodwill of Louisville. I love it. I've but never heard of it. Uh, it's Goodwill. It's where poor... No, it's but Goodwill of Louisville? That, that, that's the name of the store? <laughs> What is, no. what is going on, man? <laughs> no, it's Goodwill. I had to shop quick, and Goodwill has some cool shit. All right, so Goodwill had a red tie, had some black pants, black shirt, and I went to Walmart and got me some red socks. Get them. Woohoo! Oh, yeah. See? You like my, you like my orange? Holy shit, they're like orange, them? and your shirt's orange. Yeah, do you like orange? I do. That reminds me of the Tennessee Vols. All right. Back to you, Ryan. Okay. Okay. NBC News Nightly. This is Brian. I'm sorry, Ryan. And we are here to tell you that, holy shit, it's Survivor James on TV. We can't have this. All right. Okay, you don't speak well under pressure. I have no idea what's going on. No idea. But this is my show, and I need to be a host. And whoever sees this, call Ryan Weiss, correct? That's not me. You okay, the wrong it's line. a Ryan, <laughs> but it's all right. Ryan 697R3L. Okay. Close enough. But anyhow, call Ryan and say, it is Ryan, right? R Ryan hated. You See, I told I you. I told you, Ryan. I know Ryan, but he makes me feel like I'm retarded because I'm freaking inebriated. I don't even know what you're talking about. Are you drunk? I need a little no, bit. No, no. I've had. I'm drunk? That's I my. I never would have thought I that. know. <laughs> but you know what? I could be your host with the most. 
And is the mic even on? Did you shut it off? Yeah, okay. it's on. <laughs> I'm not messing with the mic. I don't know, man. You're hard to tell. I'm hard would, to. Would you play the game again? Hell yeah. And why haven't you? They haven't called me back. Well, what do you think of them bringing everybody back over and over again? That pisses me off. So what about Boston Rob playing again? Boston Rob, that son of a bitch don't need to be playing no more. He done played enough, that bastard. Four times. Four frickin' times. And you you played once. Once. You know why? Because I'm too funny, and they were looking for evil people, people who are maniacal. Well, they're looking for stupid people, and I think you fit that bill. Uh-oh. Wait, wait. Uh -oh. There's a chick here looking at me Would like... Would you like to come in? Here we go. Come hither. Hi, hi. <laughs> come here, baby. Okay. How you doing? My name is James, and I am. I was on Survivor, and this is Julie. Julie, tell me why you're over here. I need you to come do me a favor. Julie, I need to do you a favor. What kind of favor do you want me to do you? Um. Oh, an um. Oh, we've got a favor from hell. As long as there's not a cop involved, and I'm not going to get handcuffed and thrown into a car. You won't. Oh, no, you won't. I just need you to come over here for a minute. Somebody wants to meet you. Someone wants to meet me? Are they influential? They can be. Financially? Maybe not. <laughs> Damn! All right, I have to say to this, to the people of America and YouTube and NBC, come on, come on. I come am on. leaving the interview. Goodbye.